Hey, what's up guys? It's your boy Wacko Jacko here. It's been a bit of time since I've uploaded anything, but hopefully more stuff's on the way. So apologies if you are sticking around. Thank you very much for keeping your subscription. If you're new, hit that subscribe button beforehand. Basically, this video is kind of a different thing. Um, I'm just going to introduce you to it before you see it. Um, I think it was about my second year of university. Um, I got given a, not a challenge of sorts, but just a video concept that they wanted me to do of sort of a budget type challenge where I had a certain amount of money that was my own. Like they, they didn't give it to me or anything like that. It was basically a case of I had £50 and they wanted me to just see how much I could save by the end of the week. I'll explain it all in the video anyway. But it's sort of a sort of giving you a perspective of what's to come. You may notice I'm a bit, I look a bit rough in some <laughs> some parts of the video, but that was due to stress from uni. I was dealing with some housing issues um, when I was living there during my second year, and it was also COVID. Um, I have sort of we found out about COVID in sort of that area, so. Don't worry about the presentation of myself. I do look a bit rough. There is me in a suit where I still look absolutely awful, but I look a lot better now. But either way, um, hopefully you enjoy the video. Um, if you do, let me know. Um, maybe I'll try and do it again in a different concept. But if you've got any ideas, let me know. Enjoy the video, guys. What was I doing? See you later. <laughs> Hey, what's going on guys? It's your boy Jack here, ready for another vlog for the university. So, the university has challenged me to live a week on a certain budget. So, I, on a, I every week, have £50 budget to go by. So I'm thinking, how much can I reduce that to save myself a bit of money? So I'm going to take you guys with me for a budget week. Let's go! So guys, here are the rules of the challenge for this week. Basically, I have one week to save as much money as I can. If I go over £50, I fail the challenge, full stop. That won't happen. Second rule. Yes, you're probably thinking, he's already gone to shopping, so he's going to win. I actually have, I will prove it to you. I've got that up there, this bread, the end date is the 22nd and we are the 19th so halfway through the month it's gonna go off halfway through the month halfway through the week it's gonna go off my freezer is just got like chips and waffles stuff like that well today is Sunday the 19th of January the challenge starts now I have 50 quid but I've got my job is to save as much as I can over this week. I'm hoping to try and like get £20 out of this week. This is including social life as well, so my going out and everything. So, Sunday is technically my, is actually my shopping day. Go shopping, bring the receipt, and go through it with you guys when I get back. So, let's go to Asta. The problem of driving. It's, that's not mi that's mist. That's not that's not clouds. That's pure mist. So attack. Right, guys. Forty-five minutes to shop. Here we go. Asda, let's do this. We are back, guys, from our trip to Asda. Uh, went well. Got everything that I needed. Uh, here is the receipt for it. So there isn't much there, but it's enough for me to fill. It's, it's enough for the week. It's a ten spent. Right. That's so. That's a week done. That's a week of food shopping done. What I'm going to do? Just going to chill out for the rest of the day. Um. And yeah, and then see how we get on tomorrow. 
Right guys, day two, we are here, day two on the budget challenge. What's happened? Nothing much, but I have just got my hair cut and that was a tenner gone there. So now that only puts me on 30 quid for this week. For anything else that I need to do, so socials, going out, having fun. I will catch you guys in a bit because there's nothing really else going on. I'm gonna head back home, get some lunch, which I've already pre-made. But yeah, let's go. Right, another day, nearly finished. The time itself is about quarter to four, and I'm off to work for, the, for an evening club. Can't mention anything else. But yeah, I haven't really spent anything today. Budget challenge, so well. So, spent 20, 30 quid left, but it is only Monday. So I've, only, I've still got five days to go. And that's include, I've got socials on Wednesday. And I don't know what else, I'm sure stuff, other stuff will come up, but I will probably leave it there for the day. Got dinner ready when I get back. So yeah, I guess that's it for the day. So I'll catch you guys tomorrow. So guys, that, I would say that is day three, but nothing's really happened. I'll let you know what actually happened in terms of the budget challenge. Basically, I had 20 pounds this morning. The time is now like three o'clock in the afternoon. I haven't vlogged because one, I tried to vlog in the morning, but when I was going, it was drive, there was loads of cars and you just couldn't hear anything. So, 20 pounds from today. This morning I had to go in early so I had to buy a hot chocolate at the place that was two quid so that puts me down to 18 quid now for the rest of the week. Yeah, it's going to be a close one so we'll keep you updated. Tonight I'm off to do some badminton stuff which I've already paid for for the year so I don't need to worry about any, any cost things there. So yeah, we'll just keep you updated probably it'll probably be tomorrow now so have a good night guys <laughs> um but yeah keep you posted and i'll catch you in a bit right guys tonight is the night we are officially halfway through the budget challenge today is wednesday night that means it's social night you know what that means fun night so 18 quid to my name for this challenge. Let's see if I can try and win some rock, paper, scissors things for drinks. So let's go. Okay, guys, it is Thursday night, and what have I done? I've gotten to record the whole day. Whoops, but nothing's happened. No money spending today. Just a chill day of work and assignment work. But the real question here was. What happened last night? I'll tell you what happened. I spent a total of ten pounds. So that means I have only got eight quid left for the rest of the week. So I got so today's finished, thank God. So I got Friday, Saturday, and then Sunday. Friday, so tomorrow, I'm off I'm back home I'm going back home to see my parents. So that's no money spent there. Saturday again with my parents, Saturday night we went back, back to Canterbury and then Sunday is shopping but do I count, I'm not going to count, I can't count shopping so Saturday's the last day so I've technically done it, I've got eight quid left and I'm, go, I'm just going out with my family over the weekend so boys, he's only gone and done it, he's only gone and done it, yes but it's not official until Saturday evening so Let's just see how we get on. Right guys, so that is the end of the challenge. Basically what happened over the, well see Friday night, I went back to my parents place. I was celebrating my dad's birthday, so yeah. Um, Saturday I spent the whole day with my family, so I didn't really spend anything. And then Sunday, well, I just, 
I was working and everything, so it was all done. So, Sunday didn't really count anyway, because that was the start of the challenge. So, anyway, at the end of the challenge, I got 50, I had 50 quid, I only had eight pounds left, so I spent a total of 42 pounds, but 10 pounds for the haircut, which I'm going to get into one again soon, is going very quickly. Um, but yeah, uh, that's about it guys. Thank you very much for watching this vlog. I'm hoping you have enjoyed watching me struggle with money. Um, I didn't really struggle, but it's just one of them funny things, isn't it? I kind of want to do more challenges for like you guys and everything. So if you are watching this, let me know other challenges you want me to do on the Canterbury uh, University site. Anything university related would be good. Um, yeah, catch you a lot later and have an awesome day. See ya.